Welcome to Tawi Tawi. From the vibrant, bustling center of Bongao to the calm canals of the Philippines' southernmost municipality, via the country's oldest mosque, built on Simonol in 1380. Join me for possibly my most exciting adventure yet. Since Cotabato Airport's closed for now, the only way into Tawi Tawi is via Zamboanga. But just when I thought everything was in peril, 15 to 20 minutes later, it was all good. It was fixed. And we were going again. Here we are. Some wonder. The least exciting bit of Chavacano ever. I love that language. Right, let's see if someone's coming to pick me up. See if I can find it. Oh, I always like a lamb. Hello, lamb. Look at my mommy. Hi. Hello, Welcome. Mom. Thank you. And I'm so grateful for those who offer up their homes, even just for a night between flights. Nice. Salamat ka ayo, ha? Bye-bye. Oh, mali ko buwan, ha? Buwan. Buwan. Oh, my guest to Carol, no? Oh, hi. Hi. Let's do it. We flew over the Sulu Archipelago and touched down at the Sanga Sanga Airport in Bongao, the capital of Tawi Tawi. Yeah, just around Tawi Tawi. Yeah. So Bongao, Sitangai, some other places, yeah. Are you, are you gonna ride uh, Bang Bangka or no? Just gonna stay in Bangka? Bangka, uh, Bangka, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'll ride away. Yeah, thank you, huh? Thank you. Shout out, shout out to Commander Dao. Thank you so much for flying with us. Enjoy your stay. Thank you, huh? We were greeted by the Pangalai, a traditional Bajau courtship dance, and then a very unique baggage carousel. I see my bag, I don't know if I'm allowed to just like take it or I don't know how this works. It's okay. I like this, I don't have to chase it around the belt. It doesn't move. Hey. Welcome to Tawi. Thank you. <laughs> Welcome to Tawi Tawi. Okay. And a tricycle. Well, it's the most authentic way, right? Welcome to Tawi Tawi. Put one down. Right? Yeah, wow. It's a beautiful, beautiful place. Wow, over the pits, yeah. Yeah, wow. Ah, we Messiah. Yeah, I can speak Messiah. How about you? You can, you can speak Messiah, bro. Yeah. I can speak, but I'll. Ah, Gamay Lang. Gamay. Ah, okay. But the language here is. What's the language here? Tausu, Muslim. Ah, oh, oh, Mosi Tausu. Gamay language. Asibi. Asibi? Asibi. Asibi. Ah, okay, Asibi. The I... name is Nan. So Asibi and Selmo. Ah, uh, okay. Because I only know so far, I only know Matsuko. Matsuko, yeah. Oh, Matsuko. Bongao Poblacion is the trading center of these islands, and before we explore on foot, 
we'll just leave our bags at the hotel. We made it, this is where we're staying, Clears in. Welcome to Bong Dao, Tawi Tawi, and just that tricycle ride in, Al, cool guy. Really, it's vibrant here, really incredibly vibrant, and it feels a little bit like, I don't know, reminds me a bit of Malaysia or India. There's some of the smells in the air are a bit different, and of course, Malaysia's just a little bit that way, so it's really close. I respect the integration there, because they have a long, long history of trading, especially to Sabah, over the ocean. So, yeah, let's go out and explore. This is, it's a vibrant place for sure. The trading areas of Bongao are actually pretty compact, and it's much easier to explore the narrow streets by foot. And I immediately made a new friend. Hey! <laughs> Hello! I'm your follower. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Same with that. I've never seen dried stingray before, but here we are. Wow, and this, wow, look at this. Something tells me we're near the port. <laughs> so, my other guides, <laughs> these guys are from tourism office, so, hello. <laughs> if you ever concerned about coming here, they told me I actually have a night to walk around by myself if I like. There's no problem, they said it's safe. The police are low-key monitoring me, but, you can walk around by yourself, but if you want to really arrange it, go for tourism. Bongai tourism, everyone's so friendly, everyone's really, really welcoming, smiling. It's... There's a distinct Filipino spirit here, but it's it's different, you're next to Malaysia. So much seaweed, we're right by the ocean, this is the Chinese pier we're walking onto now. Named the Chinese Pier for the Chinese and Arab merchants who traded with the locals for centuries, it's now the main dock for lanchers going to the other municipalities of Tawi Tawi. This is the best view of all, the big wooden boats, very, very traditional to this region. Don't have the lancha. But this is all made of wood? Yeah, yes sir. Wow, it must take so long to build it. Yes, it was two to three years. That's a big yes sir. If there is no supply of wood, they cannot build that. Yeah. Wooden bowl. Hi. <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay, this one is, I mean, it's literally going straight up. It's uh, <laughs> scoreboard. Hi. Wow. It's big, huh? Hey. Hello. Oh, I can go on board. Good okay, luck. Okay. Okay. I'm going to go explore on board. I don't think they know I'm here. I'm slipping on the paint. <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh, wow. No, it's really... Hello. Hey, hey. Hey. Oh, really wanted. Hello. Hello. Good. How are you? I'm fine. Good, good. Good, good. good. This one going to... Which place? To? Tangana. To? Tangana. Ta Tangana. 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 Yeah, oh. yeah. So, Malayo? No, Malayo. Malayo. Oh, okay. Tangana mm. is other names of the Turtle Island. It's one of the municipalities in Tawi Tawi. Turtle Island? Yes, sir. Yes. Oh, wow. That's far. How, how, many, how many hours? It's uh, 20 hours. Oh, far. 20 hours? Wow. Okay, nice to meet you. Thank you. Ah, okay, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, yeah. Bye bye, bye bye. Hello, ma'am. Hello. 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 <laughs> and the, <laughs> and it really is the wood on the floor goes like that. I don't know if you can appreciate it. I've got to come back down now. This is uh, scary. <laughs> it's a good view though. But this pales in comparison to navigating 20 hours across the open sea. And I found out later, this boat only goes okay. once a month. What's that? That is Malaysia, made in Malaysia. Oh, yeah, okay. I might have to call that number. I always wanted one of these boats. I want one of these boats. <laughs> 35,500, that's not bad. Not a bad price, just repaint it. <laughs> oh, it's so cool. There's so much for sale here. And adjacent to the pier is the central market of Bongao. Unfortunately, it was midday in rough sea season when we visited. 
so it wasn't at its booming best, but it's still a great traditional bar to market. So fish here is not sold by kilo, it's sold either by bundle, so 100 per bundle or per piece, 120 per piece. Kutamba. Kutamba. Ah, Kutamba. Kutamba. This one is... Bale. 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 Makano. <laughs> I've never seen this one before. It looks like, almost looks like the rubber from a shoe. Oh, what the? 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 My brothers, my brothers. Hello. 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 Okay. 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 And nobody minded that I was just walking through. We had a different plan for lunch. Now we're going to go into the vegetable market. I love fish markets. It's very, very good value fish. 500 to 4 kilos. I want to try some of this, but later. It's middle of the day. Uh, Hello! Do you know what is this? No. A burning coconut. Oh, that's yeah. the burning coconut. So yes, you, you can buy it by a piece. So, uh, for the rice. Wow. Oh, very good. Taka from Bongao. Oh! Tawit Awian. Okay, okay. Oh, Bongo Guru. Oh, oh, oh. Very good. Oh, wow. No, British. British, yeah. Yeah, British. American? No, no, UK. German? No, you know, you know London. London, from UK, British. Yeah, UK, UK. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, your name is. I'm very happy to meet you. Ah, uh, very yeah, happy to meet you. Akto, you is Akto. How you Akto? Ah, your name is. Your name. And Malu, you are Malu. Ah, there's a disability. Ah, okay. But you walk good, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Matsuko, Matsuko. Thank you, nice to meet you. Okay, let's go here. Okay, see you again. There's so many, so many like this. This is awesome, this is so, it's just fun, you know? People are so, so outgoing. Hey. Oh, vlog. <laughs> Chill, man. Wow, this is cool. We're here somewhere in Bonga. We're gonna eat just local Cavendaria. I don't know what any of this is, so maybe you can help me choose. Actually, I know what this is. That's a fish. That has some magic red sauce. This has a magic yellow sauce. This one's a fine too. Oh, I definitely want this. I'm so happy. There's Tiura Itong. That's what I've been looking for. This is my favorite thing in the world black beef soup with spices and of course the black and coconut someone's mad outside so this is utak utak fish coconut this looks good so everything looks amazing and what's this one coconut milk this is and this is beautiful Kyoto and Shangla, these are made of cassava. Okay, so I mix it with the rice? Even no. no. Oh, okay, so even not. Yeah. So how should I how should I have this? Um, just... A taste first, yeah. okay. So before I do that, so this is for hand washing. Okay, so cassava. Yes, this traditional Sama staple food should be eaten with a side dish. Okay, let's try all this together. Mmm. Okay. Thank you. Hello, 
Wong Gao is delightfully vibrant and colourful. So this on the central island here comes from the Tepo, which is the local weaving, the local mats. So everything, it's all colourful. It's the traditional way of seeing things and I really like that. And beside this cool wooden hospital is another side of life in Bongao. So we've come to the Badjao village and as you can see it's all on stilts and it's very low tide. And even in places elevated above the sea, there's still plant eaters. Savvy Savvy stores. No, oh, what's this? Mali guy. Yeah, small house, but like a palace. <laughs> what's this one used for? Used for uh, tradition, used for uh, wedding. Yeah. They're putting some uh, native delicacies around here. Oh, wow, okay. With uh, giant, giant lobster, tiangang manuk, yellow rice, and more foods. Yes, sir. Okay, wow. But from here, the going got a little bit tough. Oh, that's a nice part there. <laughs> the further we go in, the more that up this bridge gets. But we have to remember, people actually live here and walk over this every single day. So. Kim! <laughs> but there are also some housing project areas that are also floating. I love this, this is like a, it's like a banker in concrete. This is a Barangay Pagasa, so this is a housing project, right? Hello. Hi. Hello. And in one of these homes is their weaving association. Benita. Benita Jo. Aja Benita Jo. Yes. Okay, hi, nice to meet you. Yeah. Yeah. This one is for decoration. These ones they use the dwarf pandan leaves. So the dwarf leaves are uh, thinner more, and then and then naturally coloured. What do they use to colour this? Uh, Anji B. This one is take uh, three to four months to weave. This one is four to five days. Most weavers start around the age of twelve and it's a really intricate skill. Oh, Filipino na ang anak. So this one you explain the edge guy. Seco seco. Seco seco. Ah, zigzag seco seco. Okay, okay. Balang boras. Balang boras. Balang boras. Balang. Balang boras. Balang boras. Pinana. Pinana. Pana. Pinana. Pana. What's? Ah, ah, abo. Okay, okay, abo. Okay, this one. Costa. 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 Chicken. Ah, chicken. Ah, how much chicken? Oh, chicken. So this one's chicken. This this design is chicken. 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 These designs. Where did these designs start? How did you learn these? Their initiative. The design is Pinama. Oh. Pama is uh, ah, lobster. Ah, lobster. Ah, lobster design. Mm. Ah, yes. So your designs are things, things around yes, you. Yes, yes. So from your life. From your life. Oh, okay. I All design oh. regarding matter is uh, from that idea. Yeah. That initiative. Yeah. To make idea. Wow. Okay. Okay. Beautiful. I love this one. What's what's this one? Banana. 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 Same. Same. Banana. Same. Same. Ah, okay, but red. My bag came with six kilos. I have 20 kilos allowance, which means I'm gonna, I've got to take stuff back. Wow, okay. Later that afternoon, it was getting a bit hot. So we went back downtown for a traditional Bongao merienda. Everything we eat, we pay for. If you leave it on the plate, you don't pay. You have a choice. How about if you get a bite of one and then leave it on the plate? Our <laughs> <laughs> uh, rice flour with sweet grated coconut inside. Wajit rice flour. Sikalang, this rice flour with sugar. Pangi pangi. 
flour with sugar and fried with oil. Apam. 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 Uh, I was waiting all day to make that joke. This one is dara that's made of flour with sweet beaded coconut. Rice flour was a very common ingredient. But... That's overwhelming, eh? But also overwhelming in a good way. I'm not feeling crazy, it's just I've taken in a lot, but I love this place. It's really, there's something special about it. There's something really amazing, really vibrant, and most importantly, the people are so friendly and so welcoming and so genuinely happy to see people visiting their place. It's what I really, really like. Wow. I'm talking really quickly, which means I need to breathe more, but I'm very, very excited for four more days of exploring here.